Good morning. We're looking at British American Tobacco Malaysia today. CGS CIMB Research is keeping its whole call and target price of 15 ringgit 40 cent after Harian Metro's expose on the Ben Gang. BAT closed at 14 ringgit 66 on Monday. To recap, according to Harian Metro's expose, the Ben Gang has a stranglehold on Malaysia's contraband cigarette market. The government has implemented an embargo on cigarette transshipment at seaports to curb smuggling. But the tabloid reported that the ring has successfully recalibrated its modus operandi. CGS CIMB said in a note that it has not highlighted the cigarette transshipment ban as a possible catalyst for BAT because this alone cannot effectively thwart the multi-billion ringgit criminal activity. It said Haria Metro's expose implicitly illustrates Malaysia's structural socio-economic woes and pointed out that the real problem besetting BAT is affordability, not criminal activity. The fact is Malaysians simply cannot afford legal cigarettes as they lack the purchasing power which is deteriorating on the back of the MCO. It doesn't help that Malaysia's cigarettes are one of the most expensive in the world relative to income, according to CGS. CIMB's own analysis. The research house is projecting an FY21 revenue of 2.495 billion ringgit, which is 7.7% higher year on year, but a tad shy of FY19's 2.51 billion ringgit. It said it still believes BAT's catalyst lies in the legalization of electronic cigarettes and vaporizer products. But it fears that this may not take place in 2021, as there may be more pressing issues that the lawmakers will want to hash out first when Parliament reconvenes. So what's the consensus? According to Bursa Marketplace, there are five buys, eight holes, and two sells on BAT. Average target price 14 ringgit 22, three percent lower than BAT's last close of 14 ringgit 66.